So did Trump like, get arrested? We're recording this on the Tuesday. Did he get arrested yet or Trump's not? not getting arrested, guys. Uh, Come on. Don't do this. Don't do this. <laughs> what? Don't do this. He's not getting arrested, Don't guys. Come do on. this. Somebody go find Are the video where these exact serious? words to Charlemagne, and you were saying he's getting arrested. I'll bet any amount of money. I said this three years ago. I put it like this. Hold on. If they indict a, if they indict a former president, it's not going to be for these charges. These charges are weak as f Hold on, hold on. But you did say <laughs> this guy. That, that you did say that he was going to get arrested. And I was like, they won't arrest a former president. Yeah, I think I agree with you. <laughs> yeah, I, I think I, I think I agree with you. I don't see it happening, bro. This so, man, I can't change my mind. So, upon yo, further you review, you said it with so it. much conviction, I though. I, I, I believed it. in the checks I and balances. I, I believed it. that nobody is above the law. <laughs> Teflon Don has proven me wrong. Until further notice. And I still don't think that they'll do it. But I don't like think this. they'll do it either. If you got, he's got all of these federal charges he's facing, right? Merrick, Merrick Garland. We already know the classified documents shit. You might as well throw that out. They done got caught everybody with right, classified right. documents. That's out the window. The I thought it was some taxes in New York that they wanted to catch him on. That's still open. That's still open. Yeah, That's still open? they're still investigating now. Oh, I didn't see that yeah. one. But every one like, of these rich motherfuckers breaks the law with taxes. But and, and man, basically, said, they're saying that this small thing is just to hold them, and then there's going to be a bunch of other charges They're saying everywhere. this shit is a misdemeanor. Nah, no, I know. Saying, this is just like... What they're saying is, look. Trump, don't run for president. Yeah. That's what they're saying. But and so, he's not getting the message. So why make him bigger? You know what this shit is, man? You remember in Endgame when Thanos got hit in the chest? And he's like... <sighs> You should have went for the head. Yeah, if it's yeah. not a headshot, yeah. don't do it. So rumor is, is that a bunch of charges are going to start dropping from everywhere around the country. It, so it, they, the, they said New York, the Atlanta, Ballot Georgia, shit. and the yeah. federal charges. That's only five. I heard five solid ones. That's a lot. Not really, because this shit is a misdemeanor. Like, yo, yeah, I, you gonna need more than this to arrest a, a president. Yes, bro. and they talk about they, yo, they talk about indicting him, but not handcuffing him. Yo, all you're doing is that making them bigger. I guarantee nah, you over happens. the last couple of days, all you've seen is so many donations going to Trump shit. I mean, that is 100% right. If if you arrest him and he gets off, he's president guaranteed. They say this is a mis They say this right here in New York is already a guaranteed misdemeanor. And I'm going to tell you what else is fucked guaranteed up about it. Guaranteed misdemeanor? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like it, it won't be a felony. They say it oh, won't be a felony. Oh, oh, oh. But I'm saying even putting him through this process is going to be enough to galvanize... Yeah. Already Every happening. person who is anti-establishment, because this is abuse of power from the establishment. Already happening, man. People it's, that I've talked to, did somebody just somebody sent me this? It's not it abuse like, of power. You don't think? Nah, they because like he actually did these crimes. It's just usually they don't in know the if this past, is a crime, though. Nah, it is though. They don't know if this is a crime because they said that, that, that somebody sent me this yesterday. It was like this isn't like you know uh, one of the mobsters with tax evasion. It's more like one of the mobsters stealing a carton of cigarettes when he was on the come up. Nah, so the DA never really charges people unless they know they can win. Like their success rate is crazy hot. Yeah. But so I'm they've sorry. been investigating this one for so long. They and threw they, it out though. They no, threw it out years ago. No, but this ago. is just, um, they used campaign funds to pay off um, Stormy Daniels, they can't, allegedly. They, exactly. They can't prove it if it was actually if, campaign if funds. If the lawyer starts talking, they can. I don't think that's going to happen. So buddy. so here, now it's all contingent on the lawyer. So they're going to try to put as much pressure as they possibly can. Yeah. But eventually it's going to seem like, I don't know. By the way, we don't even know if the DA really wants to press charges. Well, that's the thing. This I came from Trump. Yeah, Trump but, put this out there. Oh, that's Trump's interesting. Trump's team said we, never, we haven't heard from the DA's office. Trump put this Wait out there. Wait a minute. So <laughs> Trump, oh, wow. He has to be looked at as the victim. He has to be looked at yes. as an underdog. So he's putting this information out yes. so people come to his aid and his in his support. They're afraid of me. They don't want me to run. Look at this. They're trying to arrest me. They're trying to lock me up because they know that I can win. He was cold in these streets. Everybody was on DeSantis. He wasn't. No, he, no they weren't. Not everybody was Bro, on DeSantis. Bro, the GOP mm. primary polls got Trump winning Where? by a landslide. Where? I don't know why we keep saying this. I keep telling you. How you sleeping let, on your boy? Let, let me, let me, uh, let me, clarify let me re-say what i'm saying yes i believe he does win the primary mm -hmm. but the energy in the republican party was towards desantis it seemed like the republican party wanted desantis to win that big guy who owns a citadel what's his name um it's the uh, hedge fund citadel uh look that up real quick uh ken griffin ken griffin i, I think ken griffin 
So <laughs> yeah, Ken Griffin, he he actually supported Trump originally, and he switched his allegiance, I think, to DeSantis. A lot of big donors going to DeSantis. So this is the first big push I've seen in the Trump direction but why in a do, while. Why and do if we, he made it happen himself? Trump still was making raising more money than DeSantis. Raising more money than all of them. And here's the thing. Why do we not act like the Republicans aren't the biggest dick-riding party in the world? Yeah, they're going to get in line. They're going to get in line. Yeah, but they're hedging their bets, though. Because they, they, they always really, do. Yeah, We've so it's seen like, this movie but before. They, they did that shit the first term with, uh, with they put everything in Jeb's coffin. Yeah. Yes. Right? And then... Trump oh, caught fire. He did. That's right. That's the thing about this. Yeah, man. I wonder, I, I genuinely don't think that people want to deal with the chaos that comes with Trump. I think people enjoy this kind of malaise that we're living in right now where, like, you don't have to worry about spy balloons. A lot of people, if there's global economic collapse, nobody's really caring about it. Like, there's all these crazy <laughs> things that are happening, and then people just aren't really caring. That is wild. And it's very simple. You have a president that doesn't talk about anything, and now you have nothing to rage against. Anytime Biden does talk or mumble, he doesn't say anything coherent enough where, like, you can rage against it. With Trump, everything that he said became the polarizing issue of the week. Trump made everybody pay attention. Exactly. So nobody's paying attention to really the news. We don't want to pay attention. Yeah. yeah we guess, actually yeah. don't as yeah. human beings. No, and everybody's really right. enjoying this time right now, and I don't know if they want to be re-engaged. That's why they say ignorance is bliss. That That is exactly what's happening no, right No, you're now. right. You're right. You're right. It's interesting, though, man. I don't think... I, I don't know if he goes to jail or not, but I don't think he gets indicted for this shit right here. Like, this shit It's got to be something bigger. It's got to be something bigger. And I'm going to tell you, mm -hmm. he can spend... He's already spending this to his advantage. His advantage. Why? Because Alvin Bragg is black. Who's that? Alvin Bragg is the DA in New York. So when you I thought can, it was a girl. No, he's a black man. He's, Alvin Bragg. He's, there was he's a, fairly new, though. There was a be, black uh, woman that was going after him, uh, too. No, that's his uh, James. Uh, his James is the attorney general. Oh, that's oh, the attorney yeah, general. Yeah. Alvin okay. Bragg is the DA. So, but both of them, Tiz James was pushing Alvin Bragg to press these charges. All you got to, it's just the optics. This is wokeness. All his followers got to do, go look at his campaign ads right now. Mm. Who's facing them campaign ads? That's true. Alvin fucking Bragg. Wow. Got them guys speeding down the turnpike trying to get to New York on 26 from the country, coming from Long Island, everywhere. We got to go defend our guy. That, the optics of that, wokeness, black man. Black woman. People don't care about that woke shit anymore, bro. Yes, he's, they yeah, do. He's, he's, he's using the term. Yes. He said this uh, is an he's, attack he's, from the woke. He's 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 late, bro. It's, he's antiquated. It's over. Nobody man, cares man. about that shit no more. Nah, 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 nah. It's nah, big. Yeah. It's big. Nah, it's big. Because even DeSantis is using the woke card. Like all of them are using the that's, woke card. That's their card, enemy, bro. That's huh? that's what they label all liberals as. Yeah, I know, but I'm just saying they got to figure something else out because the woke shit is kind of done. Like, the kids ain't woke anymore. Like, the youth, youth, the youngsters out here, like, the kids who are in college right now, they're rejecting the wokeness of the generation before them, so they're wild motherfuckers saying all the crazy shit. Like, I think white people, uh, well, not white people, but the Republican Party co-opted wokeness and did what they always do, which is flipping and bouncing and remix it, so it's not it's not even cool. <laughs> like, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So now you got liberals on TV denouncing wokeness Yep. Because they know Republicans have already co-opted it, so they can't even use the phrase anymore. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. I, I I just don't see him going to the, the, getting getting indicted for this. I just don't. And if I was if I was a big dog, if I'm Merrick Garland or one of them, I'm telling the DA in New York to fall back. Fall back, man. Yeah, you're just heating them up. Fall back. Let's try to get some of these bigger charges that you know we probably actually can freaking get them on. But I don't mm -hmm. see them in I don't see them. I don't see them locking up a former president. I've been trying to tell y'all this shit for a long fucking time, yo. Mm -hmm. you no, know? you haven't, actually. This is the first time you've ever said it. <laughs> so, but it's good that you just said it right now, and I almost believed you. <laughs> it's truly remarkable what you're It's just kind of wild. It's just like, yo, why? They've never arrested a former president, indicted a former president. Why would they on these charges? Yeah. Like, these are, these, no. Well, they can't get them on the actual shit. I guess. I mean, Trump's probably... I'm telling you, they, yeah. they're going to get him on this. It will be a misdemeanor. It won't be that serious. They're going to get him on the tax thing. That might be serious because that's more federal. Yeah. So that might actually prevent him from now, running. If, if anything, but, it's the stuff in Georgia. But even once again with that, it's a black woman DA. What's the Georgia shit? The Georgia is the... Uh, I think it's the, the, the election tampering. Yeah. Pull, pull, it, pull it up. Georgia. When he was like calling them, tell them, yo, I need you to find the votes. Yeah, he said it was a perfect yeah. call. You didn't see him today? Play, play Trump from the day, Taylor. You just had it up. You didn't hear him today, yo? No, what he said. 
Greatest stand up in the country. Yeah, he's, yeah, he's so <laughs> lovable. He's so lovable. If he wasn't fucking a threat to the free world, play. if he was on your side, I want a Bullworth. I've always said I want a Bullworth style president. Mm -hmm. And Trump is definitely a Bullworth well, style president. If you've never seen that? the movie Bullworth, is this it? Oh, play Whether this. Whether it's shit, man. the Mar a Lago raid or the unselect committee hoax, the perfect Georgia phone call who was absolutely perfect. Or the stormy horse face Daniels <laughs> extortion plot. <laughs> They're all sick. Come on, man. It's fake news. Our enemies are desperate to stop us because they know that we are the only ones who can stop them. And they know it very strongly. And they're looking at the polls where not me, but we are up by so much. They can't even believe it. We won twice and now we've got to win a third time. They know that we can defeat them. They know that we will defeat them, but they're not coming after me. They're coming after you. I'm just standing in their way, and I always will stand in their way. Thank you very much. Aren't we exhausted of the they're coming after you, like be afraid every two seconds? It's been no, nice for a few works. years to not be no, afraid. But, but here's the thing. That that has been the Democrat <laughs> that has been the Democratic playbook for years. And the yes. Democrat and both. Republican. Don't fear. Both of them. Both. 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 Republican definitely and both. Democrat. Def definitely both. But no one's afraid right now. It's kind of nice. We're not even afraid of global economic doom. We're not now, afraid I'm, I'm, of I'm, Chinese spy balloons. We're not afraid of anything. There's I'm no not, fear. I'm not afraid because I'm not allowing myself to be afraid. But so many people are afraid of this economy yes, and 100%. their bank accounts and yes. inflation. Are they afraid of the it? Bank yes, thing, they I, did, I definitely had some conversations about the bank thing with my financial people. Like, you sure? You know what I mean? That, 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 was, that was scary. But like I'm looking at this article right now. Some Democrats fear arresting Trump could backfire, question screen for charges. Some Democrats fear that the potential charges facing former President Trump from the Manhattan DA are not up to the task and could backfire. Mm. Um, this is an open and shut books and records misdemeanor. Yo, you know what's kind of funny? Now to elevate it to a felony is complicated. You remember all the, uh, remember all the Republicans that were like, yo, we can't give out these, uh, what, what did they call, what were they called? Like bonuses and shit during the pandemic? S stimuluses. Oh, stimulus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah we yeah, can't yeah. give out all these stimuluses. We can't print this money. We can't do this shit. We can't, it's bad for the economy. You can't do this. What? <laughs> Where are they with all these people who are bailed out at their banks that failed? Like, I want to know where the, the conservatives are who constantly criticize government interference. Oh, got you, got I you, I want to know you, where you, they you. are right now when the government interfered and secured their deposits at the banks. I've yet to hear one of them speak out about how inefficient Why government they? is. Why would they? That's their stimulus. One hundred percent. I just, I just, I, I think at some point we just need them to go. Okay, you know, sometimes it is nice to have a government. Sometimes yeah, it is nice yeah, that the government yeah. has your back. Sometimes yeah. it is nice that the government interferes. Yeah. Don't get me wrong. I don't want to pay more taxes. I want to pay less taxes. I'd love to. That'd be great. I get where they're coming from, but at the same time. It is nice to have the security of the government there Absolutely. to potentially protect you from cir circumstances like Absolutely. this. Absolutely. Absolutely. I mean, they'll never let the economy totally fucking crash. Well, that famous last words, my boy. Famous last words. <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't ask for it. Don't ask for it now. This, this, this article says there are far more serious crimes Trump should be held accountable for. And they said, this is the biggest thing. Bragg's investigation Chill. is just one of three Trump is currently facing and the charges stemming from it may be the easiest ones for Trump to defeat. A failed prosecution of the former president who <laughs> opponents have long dreamed of locking up could only serve to bolster his common refrain that he is the victim of a witch hunt. That's true. Yeah. 